Hello and welcome back to another episode of Long War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing with our legendary Iron Man playthrough. Operation Morbid Fist is uh, the next that we want to do. This is going to be some smash and grab. We need money badly, uh, not only to build a couple of buildings, but we also need it uh, to do research. So in order to meaningfully progress and not stall the research, I need money and then afterwards finally the buildings uh, will come so that's really where we are uh, where we currently stand uh, operation morbid fist better be a success if we get four to five crates i think uh, that that would be good if we get more than that that would even be awesome all right let's jump into the mission and see how we're doing all right so smash and grab this is one of the missions where we do have five canisters and uh, we might be able to get all five uh, let's take a look does this trigger it does not okay which in return means sniper can move all the way to here Gunner moves to gunpoint. Toxic. That's not a bad position. And Grenadier. We gotta be careful, there are loss in this mission. So the amount of grenades might be a problem. Double newt sector. The nudists go for another little swim here in the pool. Although I told them often enough that they shouldn't. Mind merge. I do. Okay. Still mind merge uh, with uh, death now. he's going to tank for us then soul fire very nice hit this guy ground for the best hit chances 50 50 is not good enough for me we're holo targeting your little your little butt and then that is a kill who will right. double alert and poor helpful we get the kill here and finally moving up to high ground as well successful couple of first turns here free reload Next turn we can go upstairs. Absolutely. Advent forces on the ground. There was yet another pack in the background. Okay, careful. Good, one down. 
50-50 on the officer. That was not good. Moving to full cover here so that we can continue. And Namri. Let's go trigger. Wondering overwatch or reload. I don't want to take a 30% shot. I think we're reloading so that we uh, do have a full turn next turn that we can work with. Sounds like the logs are getting a lot closer to our position, Commander. Prepare for more incoming. Good. This should trigger the Viper and the Sector. Bring it on. Next turn, losts are spawning, so I'm somewhat okay with that. I was hoping I could grapple up to here and then flank him. That was the core idea. Clearly did not work out now. flanked or exposed target that one is not really exposed so I don't think that that would give us an extra shot I could flashbang which will trigger losses that might be the right call here kill zombie And these two are pretty much down. Oh wow. That ring a big one. Ooh. Namri, my dear. You're being completely overrun here. I don't know if it is a good idea, but I think this here is a 3 for 1. The losts cannot be headshotted. So. Oh, it's a 2 for 1, unfortunately, just. Let's move further away and let the lost handle it. Uh, there is another pack that I think I just triggered. So they can deal with the loss, so I don't mind. Yeah, 
in the meantime, move over here. Flank that beautiful uh, Viper. And how we can get from a flanking shot to a grazing shot is completely beyond me, but they do have a lot of dodge. So I guess that sort of makes sense. Good. All right. That one hurt. We're in the middle of a ultra big firefight. We are in the middle of a big firefight. Oh boy. Let's move to here. And let's get that Viper down. Okay. Good. Can we get the gunner? Fantastic. No problem, boss. Namri moves up closer. Gets the dasher. That guy up here is a problem. What's over there? My mind Let's get the way. officer. Okay. a little bit closer and let's hit this brute okay well rest of the turn went well there's another swarm very very close Fantastic. Can we grapple to somewhere new? We cannot. move to here take a shot right into his face and then move over to here I think that's the plan need to get away from that brute I think we can kill the engineer
Let's try to move to here. That's not flankable. Mind merge to him and we're going to overwatch. Namri places herself in full cover as well. And I would just say oh, another Overwatch. Heads needs to reload anyways. Could be our round where we are pausing a little bit. Stun Lancer might just charge in. Never mind. And the overwatches will all be drawn by the lost. They deal with loss as well. Well protected but disoriented. Reload. Free shot onto the stun lancer. And now we can run away. Opening the door, getting far enough away. Big brood is a uh, is a problem for us. These two can easily come down. Uh, I guess it'll be okay. Heads doesn't have the hit points to tank through them. Four to seven, four to six. Can't put them into insanity because they have no sanity. Sure thing. Heads can't take a great position where we can actually hit something.
Okay, not bad. Could have been worse. Time to mop him up. Okay. You guys deal with uh, the uh, with the loss. Where is the captain? Did he just run like a little schoolgirl? This might trigger a loss. Has not finally triggered, uh, fully triggered them. <coughs> uh, Mech can definitely move up and get to us, which is why we're just going to go away. Should have done that with Death from Above uh, for free reload. could go over and go for that other chest. Our oh, exit is uh, there. Boy, we are in for a long, long fight. On my way. Overwatch, reload. And I think we're just overwatching as well. We need to kill the mutant. That guy is a problem. But staying here exposed isn't great either. my trigger loss very soon but I need damage like lots of it and I need it right now
don't want to send in the open. No, there needs to be a different way. That stupid loss has made this ground here super difficult. That's the other way I was looking for. High ground. Bit of a flanking angle. <clears throat> Not bad. And let's get that officer down. <clears throat> That'll also remove the mark. Why does the Lost Swarm appear within our remittance and not within the enemies? This is completely BS. Could have easily just started on the other side, huh? And how about you going for the 150 losts? Thank you. That sounds like a plan, doesn't it? Trooper duels us on the long ground. Mech is almost down. That unfortunately they can't be exposed. And the sentry is continues to be a problem. get all of that heads cannot withstand uh, these loss so On my way. we're moving upstairs See us far enough away from the brute. It's dead. It has to be dead. Solved our main problem. Absolutely. And we're running out of time. Three losses left over. Two losses left over. Okay, we need to deal with the last guy. So, oh, let's do exactly that. No compromises. Uh, 
And that should kill him. Oh, nice. Loot on top of it. Now, we do have problems here, specifically that we're so closely... So closely entangled. Let's try to free us up. just running away need to get the loot and then as many boxes as possible there is lots and lots of loot all over the place As always, he's such a f uh, goofball. All right, reload. Then open this chest. I got the loot here. Heading out. Then moving over here. And let's try killing this brute. Okay, cool. That worked out well. That's We're finally out. by ourselves. Okay, well, I'm greedily trying to get the last couple of packs. That's two. Object secure. Moving quickly. That'll be number three. Good. That's number three here. Well, collected three, number four that we have sort of secured. Uh, I've got it. Got your stuff oh, here. the one here was an extra one. I see. Well, we can't go all the way to here. That one, unfortunately, okay. will on. not make it. Good. 
We don't want to deal with any of these guys. All we want is to get out of here. Moves to here, we can grapple hook and then move even further. I take a new approach. Moving out. I'm all over it. Going out. Go, go, go. Okay, next turn we're going to get out of here. What's up becoming more of a problem? Dasher, Dasher. Well, that should clear the way and we can finally move out I need ammunition. Heading out. Getting out of here. Just in time. indeed just in time the reinforcements were just coming in and we are getting out we got four out of five crates we got a bonus crate uh, but we got Super heavy loot, I think four or five items, five, uh, rather five. So the losses are not as easy peasy as I thought they would be. I hope we can get some corpses from them at some point and get the ultrasonic lure. Uh, the combative looks better every time that I look at it. So often, I've already I've I've noticed. Yeah, we're just I'll just do it. Chain shot is great, but combat uh, presence is fantastic as well. And. I think for the sole purpose, it costs us 2 AP, but I will do it. He had some ability points left over. 45 supplies, alloys, alarm core, and we got 4 big items. That was a good, a very, very good uh, run. We're training... Fuse is a free action now, so it's not bad. And it's the pref uh, it is the prerequisite for heavier, uh, more advanced, uh, like nullens and uh, mind control. Okay. Okay. So let's take a look. What do we need to do next? Uh, sabotage is happening very soon. What do we need to do on the strategy layer? Troop ambush happening soon. That will be harsh. Sealed armor. That one we can ignore. That one we can ignore. Blood angels on this one and HQ assault. How far are we with that, by the way? Um.
Five more days. I hate uh, the tired mechanic. But it takes so long. I don't hate it, but it just takes a lot of time. All right, everybody's training. We're efficient. That is the name of the game on the strategy layer. Be efficient. So over here we have a lot of intel. Could get one or two more missions. Down here we're not fast enough with our intel. Um, This is uh, mass recruiting here. Here we're already searching actively. I think since these guys are recruiting, uh, just double checking Haven Advisor. Yeah, down here we only have two on recruiting so it wouldn't really make a lot of difference to put a haven advisor there but we can scan if you're scanning that counts as four operatives uh, looking for intel and there we go lots of missions one of which is intel and intel package sealed armor not nice but do we have any team that is available you guys are getting ready you guys are getting ready on mission on mission which uh, means the ultramarines are theoretically ready um, you my friend are not part of the ultramarines but the rest very much is so let's select the SWAT and that would get us to a pretty heavy fortification baseline means we might need to reduce the oomph a bit more but how would we do that i can squeeze out a couple of percent points but not that many gunners and grenadiers typically count for a little bit more than the others so they, per definition, um, would be uh, good to not take them with you if you want to optimize. I'm just thinking about, I mean, are we going to spend Intel? That'll be minus six Intel for an Intel package, right? So, mm. or do we feel like fighting 20 enemies? Maybe I can reduce it just slightly. Let me check out what I can do. Good, I played around with it quite a bit. And at the end of the day, the bottom line is, unless we're going in with three, not going to make it much easier. But 20 uh, can be done. I rather upgraded what we were doing, took uh, two times ammunition, this time a med kit just in case uh, something happens. I want to try crowd controlling a little bit more uh, with the skirmisher since he can throw and then still act. Uh, that's a huge advantage. So having two flashbangs isn't too bad. Uh, heads on the other hand, is he even fast enough? Yeah, 14 is good. You know, one of the things that we could also do, just trying to mini optimize here, is we're leaving you and Heads gets one of the flashbangs. That's still the same amount of enemies and we're good. At a single grenade already pushes us up further. Um, so, no thank you. I think we could do it if push comes to shove. I might need to uh, boost this, but the Ultramarines are not going to back down from a challenge. <laughs> Excuse me. No, it's not happening. Very good. Um, so in terms of soldiers since we're, we're um, going to be ready to infiltrate the headquarter 
currently we simply don't have additional soldiers but but uh, 70 is a little bit too much I think well that would definitely fund w uh, one of the buildings I am considering to finally build the infirmary that would be quite a bit but <laughs> yeah never mind um, we wanted to get combat armor and then afterwards magnetic weapons so we've already dedicated considerable resources toward the current research project however we can move on to something else if you prefer i'll direct our efforts towards the new research project immediately commander once we've made progress i'll send word okay um unlikely that we're going to get 120 without like cutting really deep into what we do have i can sell a couple of junk items i suppose and we can take a look what we can buy but currently i don't want to really buy a lot great shinobi mm, for 70 supplies starts at the corporal would help us with scouting See, that's the problem. I'm getting too tempted to uh, to spend stuff. Spend money that we don't have. And I wanted to get a mind shield for Hogbite. This game is really good in making you poor. PCS Focus. Yeah, they knew that that one is shite. So they made it too. data pad needs to go for now i need the money actually getting quite a good amount of money here without touching corpses which leads me to believe training center would be awesome but how much longer can i uh, can i not take damage right Training center would be really good. Let's not take a unfunded uh, fast decision. So training center here, that means infirmary here, proving ground would then need to go all the way down because this will be communication. Wow, that's a late proving grounds. How? Yeah, that, but that is easily excavatable. Um, so now the age-old question. Infirmary for faster healing or training center to unlock a lot of skills? and increase the bonds the greedy one would be training center the safe one would be infirmary okay what can i do for you commander we want at least one mine shield need a sector with corpse for that Grants a bonus to Psy abilities at cost of will. Ooh, that would be good. Ooh. Good, but I should see if any of the no more Spenderino, my friend. Uh, you need to save. It's beans and rice from here, as um, Gordon Ramsay would say. Okay. We have enough missions. What do we want to do? We don't need to heal faster. Could building faster be an option? A real option? 
I mean, training center, I guess clearing would be affected, but we're not really building like a whole bunch where we're just waiting for something to come through. Um... Hmm. Well, I guess it's heal faster. Oh, it's still better than build faster at the moment. We are not waiting that desperately to to get something going. Another scientist. Okay. Wow. Loss are here. That's a tougher mission. Uh, it seems that the loss are uh, picking up. But so this one here, nine days, plenty of time to infiltrate. But look at the baseline. We're now at light moderate thanks to just strength rating eight here. Whilst here we do have strength rating zero and here we do have strength rating zero. <laughs> they moved it all into the center yeah gotta fight through that um i don't think that we do have the soldiers i mean the space wolves here are soon going to be ready but it's still a lot of enemies here this is one of those missions could wait a day or two uh, or so Base, yeah, base uh, enemy activity is not that uh, big. Um, overall, we just need more recruits. That's uh, that's the bottom line. I mean, I could get one, a shinobi, corporal. It's exactly what we need. Just costs us a couple of corpses. You will think I'm being crazy and unreasonable. But I'm not. I think I am not unreasonable. So that's 60. Now we're needing 15 more. I'll keep that core just in case. One sectored, one advent trooper. Oh, we don't even need the advent trooper. We only need 70. Bye. Johnny, welcome to the team. It's an absolute pleasure having you on board. All right, Zoo Cougar. For starters, I don't know if anyone told you, but shorts are a big no-no here. Unless your name is inappropriate Murphy, in which case, that's a different story. And since you're a shinobi, I would like you to be color-coded as one. Blade Master, yes. And combative is just fantastic. So that's good. He has death from above. Ooh. If you give him a shotgun, death from above, killing SMG. Hmm. I wonder, can, can Shinobis carry vector rifles? Well, they can carry assault rifles. That already answers my question. Damn it, bro. Good. The big problem is still tired five days. I hate it. It is absolutely obnoxious. 
or training, so that means we also can't do missions. I don't like it that my roster is so small. I would like to have a larger roster. So that brings me to the question, can I theoretically uh, stealth run um, one of the missions with a single shinobi? Well, we're already working on those. Blood Angels, Ultramarines, Heck a Workstation. Hmm. We would net end up with a lot of success. Space Wolves are almost ready. Can we extract the VIP? If we are, if we were completely uh, researching that, we would be, um, we would be at seven to nine enemies. So that's three packs. Hmm. If he gets uh, revealed, he will die, and I don't like that idea. Plus, there is really no time pressure at the moment. We can still wait a bit. It's just I don't like open missions, uh, that's all. And we currently only have three squads that are, that are working here. Intercept Advent Reinforcements. If we were to do that, theoretically speaking. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think we've uh, found that way too late. 50 uh, enemies, even with a boost, we're still at 40 and we haven't even started to fill. No, no. But uh, that means there are. That means Advent is um, moving reinforcements here and that means the strengths here will increase. Just uh, noticed that too late. But it's a difficult mission to notice. Okay, but we will need to do the next time. Operation Ghost the Breaker um, is 101% infiltrated, but we're still dealing with uh, quite a heavy resistance. Um, but I think we can do it. Anyways, that's all uh, that I've got uh, today. Uh, thank you for watching and see you soon in the next episode. Bye-bye.